CBS News correspondent Chip Reed caught up with John McCain late last night. What do you envision happening uh, tonight? What do you think the scenario is going to be? Well, I, I think these battleground states have now closed up uh, almost all of them. And uh, I believe there's a good scenario where we can win. And uh, look, I know I'm still the underdog. I understand that. But look, this is... You can't imagine, can't imagine the excitement of an individual to be this close to the most important position in the world and, uh, you know, enjoy it, enjoy it. I'll never forget it as long as I live. Barack Obama had 90,000 in Northern Virginia going crazy. How can you compete with that kind of enthusiasm? Well, again, um, Sarah Palin had 20,000 people uh, at one of her events today. We had 23,000 in a very hot day in, uh, in Northern Virginia, too. So, look, she has ignited an element of enthusiasm that I haven't seen before. This is a historic uh, election, as we all know. And I think it's up for grabs, and we're going to work hard until until the polls close. We're going to be doing some more campaigning tomorrow, believe it or not. I know, I know. Yeah. You just don't stop. <laughs> um, just, if if Barack Obama does win, mm -hmm. what is your greatest worry? Mm, I, I think we just have different philosophical differences. He really is on the far left part of, of the liberal philosophy in America. But in one he's, poll, a he's, pretty sizable percentage of people, of your supporters, said mm -hmm. they would be scared if he were the president. Oh, no, I don't. I, you know, I, I don't think that's, not, I don't, I don't think that's uh, appropriate. And I've been through this at several town hall meetings. I do believe it's not good for the country to have someone who believes we need to spread the wealth around. And that just isn't his comment to Joe the plumber. That is his record. That's his voting record. That's his stated positions. And when his own running mate says that in the first six months he would be tested by an international crisis. Look, I've been in international crises. I'd, I don't want that to happen. And it wouldn't even be happening when I'm president. If it turns That's Chip Reed with John McCain early this morning.